I it never occurred to me to learn to paint. I, I just started in my bedroom. My parents gave me a paint set and I played with it and I smeared my fingers. I used a pencil. I figured a couple paintbrushes. I took art in school, in high school, but I flunked that. So it didn't occur to me it's something you learn. So I was literally in my parents' house where I still lived and I just played, experimented. So I kind of knew, because I've seen other art I liked, I knew what I wanted to do. I, I, I wasn't, like looking back, I probably should have paid a little more attention to the teacher, but I already did have a vision, you know? So it was, it was a matter of what I saw in my head and how am I going to make this paint go in the places that I wanted to, to have the look that I wanted. So once I had the look, I just didn't feel the need to learn. Of course, it's taken me 50 years and I'm still learning, but I think it was a wise choice because it helped me develop my own style. And people say, do you teach? And I'm like, I probably would not really because I just do what I do naturally. So my advice is just do what you do, you know. Probably the biggest inspiration for my art really actually came from music because I was more into actual music of the Beatles, the Beach Boys, and um, anything like that at the time. And so the songs and the way they had a message, and it was about romance or it was about fun on the beach. I grew up by the beach and I lived by the beach. So I think I was more inspired by the lifestyle that I lived than art itself. I just conveyed it with a paintbrush and a canvas, because that's just what kind of came to me.